Well, it's, uh, as you know, a championship weekend for our conference in track and field, and that's always an exciting time. Um, you know, all the programs in the conference, they have to uh, figure out how much they want to chase a, a team title and how much they want to chase uh, a national qualifying standard. So, I mean, we're, we're the same way. And so we're, we're going to be approaching this meet in a matter in which to try to win, but then also try to keep it within a matter of which, you know, how, how can we qualify some people to a national, national meet? Ultimately, that's our goal is to, to go to the national meet and perform well there. And so uh, the GNAC fortunately has a lot of very, very talented athletes. We're going to be uh, in fields that are very, very competitive. And I think that'll lend itself there. So it's gonna be fun. It's gonna be a fun track and field, a good environment. I really like the Idaho Center. It's a good place to stage a meet. Uh, good, uh, you know, you can see everything. Um, uh, it's a relatively fast track, especially for the, the, the sprints and the jumps. Um, and uh, it's gonna be great competition. What is the difference, and you mentioned going for the title, going for the team, how does, what's the differentiation and how is it that you have to make as a coach choices, if you will? Well, you know, we, we uh, as an example, I mean, a lot of our distance kids had a good weekend this last weekend. Um, you know, pretty sure that a few of them had marks that are qualifying in the 5,000 and the 3,000. Uh, Dominic didn't run, uh, Dominic Knotts didn't run the 5,000 this last weekend. Uh, because he was a little sick, we kind of saved him a little bit. You know that strategy ended up playing true, um, and he ended up uh, setting the GNAC record in the 3,000 on, on Sunday. But that leaves him a little short in the 5,000. So you know he's going to have to try to to, to roll that 5,000 at the at the conference meet to try to see if he can get a time. Um, same time, you know, there's not too many in the field other than our athletes that can pace him through. And so we have to strategize how best to help Dominic at the same time, not that anybody else kind of enter in the mix because they've kind of pushed it a little bit. So, you know, so that'll be, that, that's going to be an interesting uh, focus because at the end of the day, we want Dominic in, in, at the national meet in the 5,000. Um, of course, you know, the sprints, you know, Jamie Ashcroft is going to be chasing it, you know, pretty hard in the 60 and the 200. This is one of her meets to do that. I mean, it's a fast track, great competition, high energy. And so I think it'll be a good opportunity for, for that. So, you know, across the board, everyone's going to be looking at trying to see how, how fast they can be and, and how far they can throw. And hopefully it, it results in great performances. I guess, would you say the mentality is try and qualify for nationals and hope the title comes with it? Exactly. Okay. That's exactly it. I mean, I'm, I, I, you know, you have, you have to give your athletes opportunity. And the opportunity, you know, to, to win a conference title is, is, is awesome, but the opportunity to participate and compete well at the national championship is what's most desired. Um, you know, Cody Thomas is another one. I mean, we're not, we're not competing him in the multi this weekend. Um, you know, he's you know, a little bit banged up. He's obviously ran very well for us this last weekend. He's helped set a GNAC record in the men's 4x4. Uh, helped us set a, a strong provisional time in the DMR, but we're not going to compete him uh, in the multi because you know he needs to to, to prepare and, and give it his best shot at the national meet. So he is going to be running the 60, the 200, uh, the 4 by 4 He's going to try a little bit in the long jump. We'll, we'll test that out, see how that goes. Um, but you know we owe it to Cody to 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 see if he can be at his best at a national meet. And you know we have a strong team. We have other jumpers. We have other uh, other sprinters. We have other you know distance kids to make that up, and you know let them have a chance to shine. Let you know, let them support Cody for a little while. Um, I still think you know based on you know the projections that you know we're going to be very very competitive, um, and if we win, it's going to be a great team win.